today, we're diving into the exciting world of AI and how NVIDIA's latest Blackwell architecture is set to revolutionize the way we train and deploy AI models. NVIDIA recently unveiled its Blackwell architecture, and it's packed with features designed specifically for generative AI and high-performance computing. So, what makes Blackwell so special? Blackwell GPUs deliver up to 2.2 times the performance compared to the previous Hopper generation. That's a game-changer for tasks like training large language models. For instance, when fine-tuning models like Llama 2 or pre-training GPT-3, Blackwell achieves a 2x performance increase, allowing researchers and developers to get results faster than ever before. But it's not just about raw power. The architecture features optimized tensor cores that enhance deep learning tasks. This means more efficient processing of matrix operations, leading to quicker training times. Now, let's talk scalability. With the new NVLink technology, you can connect up to 576 GPUs, making it easier than ever to handle complex AI workloads. This scalability is crucial for organizations looking to leverage massive AI models without breaking the bank. And don't forget about memory. Blackwell supports HBM3E memory, which means higher bandwidth and larger capacity. In fact, you only need 64 Blackwell GPUs for tasks that previously required 256 Hopper GPUs. Less hardware means lower costs and reduced energy consumption, definitely a win-win for sustainability in data centers. And there's more on the horizon. NVIDIA plans to release an even more powerful variant called Blackwell Ultra, expected in 2025. This ongoing innovation shows NVIDIA's commitment to pushing the boundaries of AI hardware. So, what do you think? Are you excited about the potential of NVIDIA's Blackwell architecture? How do you see it impacting the future of AI? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tech insights. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.